one of your children who has lost their way with you, God, that they would just come to you right now, Lord God, that they would just admit that you are their Savior. They will believe that you died on the cross for their sins, and they will confess you, Lord God, as the Lord of their life. And God, I pray that there will be a permanent life change in them, Lord God, where they will feel your joy come upon them in this moment. They will feel a peace that surrounds them in a way that they can't fathom how the situations of this world no longer impact them the way they do, but they know that in the end, you are in control, you are on the throne, and through you we will be saved. And God, I pray for those of us in this place, Lord, that you know we know you are our Lord, we know you are our God, we know that you can provide this joy, but we've just kind of lost the taste of it. We've kind of forgotten what it feels like to have your joy. God, that you will just flood us with your joy. You will flood us with your heart and your passion for people. And God, that you will just come upon us in such a way that we understand that it's no longer us fighting against flesh and blood, but us fighting against rules and principalities and spiritual things. And we won't try to make mountains out of molehills. We won't try to let the little things of this earth that the devil would throw at us to throw us off. We won't let them take over our lives anymore. But instead, we will cling to you, cling to your cross, and cling to the jewel that you can give us. I pray that we will just rely on you daily and we will just humble ourselves before you and not try to make it too much for ourselves, but for us to daily walk close to you, to progress in you. Lord, for us to work through the processes, Lord God, of your life so that you live, and for us to live the same example life, and for us to know that we have a possession of you, that you can hold on to us closely, and that you stick closer to us than a brother. And in all situations, you are God, you are on the throne, and there's really only so much we can do about that. And I pray that we would just let you just be Lord of our lives. Be with us as we go from this place, and God, tomorrow when we wake up and we can't find the joy, and we're struggling to feel that joy within us, God, you remind us of something in this message that you gave us, Lord God, just to just hold on to, to feel a little bit more joy, and for us to proclaim you as Lord of our life every day. And you never pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.